Good morning everybody. Today is Friday and it is currently 7.30 in the morning. We are on our way to the farm. Meanwhile, we just dropped by at my brother's gasoline station because my husband needs to get something and then we're gonna head to the farm. The reason why we came a little earlier today because we have a lot of things to do as well as we have an early um, deliveries for eggs today um, by the way for those who are new to this channel my name is Pia I am a retired flight attendant now based in the Philippines um, my husband and I have a small poultry business and then after a year we are growing our own chicks The good thing about driving during this time of the day is that there's not much of traffic as you all can see the flow is super duper nice and easy and I also like you to see our view of the mountains here in our farm actually this is on our way to the farms and so I really hope that we will be very productive today so when we arrived at the farm, there were already two technicians that were waiting for us. Um, that is because um, we had a few concerns about our poultry. And then they left after a few minutes of discussion. They actually made a lot of suggestion about what we can do. But the problem is that they're also focusing on giving medicine, which we don't really like doing. So this is what we normally do with our tray so i always instruct my boys to keep this clean and sanitized so once a week we do clean them with disinfectant so this is the only tray that will go inside the uh, poultry house and then once it's being weighed it's going to the paper tray Thank you. So it was just recently that we started bringing our own food, um, basically just lunch to the farm. Um, we normally just eat outside but this time um, we started bringing our food because of course it's our from it saves time. Um, we are also able to save money from this and the reason why we are eating here that is because nahihiya kaming kumain kasama yung mga staff namin dito that is because of course yung pagkain nila is budgeted na so ayaw namin makisalo siguro in, in the future we will be able to share our own baon with them but at this moment since nagtitipid tayo kailangan muna natin na ah, taste taste muna what I also love about this journey is that it taught us to be humble as you all can see kumakain lang kami sa sahig parang bumalik kami kung saan kami galing before and hindi kami nahihiya dun. this is the reason why I'm also recording all our challenges in our journey because I know one day we will go back to this time to make a change just relax take it easy you're so young that's your fault there's so much you have to go find a girl settle down if you want to you can marry you look at me I am old but I'm happy. <laughs> it happens to you, buddy, if you do not drink alcohol. So this is what we normally do after our lunch. Siesta muna. Relax. While waiting for our staff to finish their lunch as well. And then after nito, probably we will start doing all the other things that we have to do and i guess i still have to assemble all the feeders of the chicken 
Thank you, Lord, for the air we breathe, for the fresh air. So after a while, I really got bored and I asked my husband what I can do to help them because they're also busy with other things. And here I am, I found myself assembling all the feeders. Alam mo, actually natutuwa ako kasi parang yung feeling na bata ka, tapos may inassemble ka. It's a very small thing pero happy ako sa ginagawa ko ngayon. But at first, I asked my husband how to really do this. And then, dahil wala naman screwdriver na available. In the meantime, since malilit naman yung mga daliri ko, ayun, ginagawa ko siya manually by myself. Natutuwa din ako while nakikinig ako sa mga kwento ng asawa ko dun sa staff namin. Wala lang, parang ganito pala yung buhay sa probinsya, no? Hindi masyadong demanding, tsaka hindi ka nagmamadali sa buhay. Alam mo yung feeling na naglalaro ka lang. And at the same time, you also have a goal in mind. In that way, you will have a reason why you have to wake up in the morning. Parang tagline lang ng Nescafe, yung sabi nila, para kanino ka gumigising, ba diba? So in the next few days, the chicks will be here finally. So I got a message from our supplier that it will come on the 28th. So it's going to be probably about seven days from now. After this one, we will be disinfecting the whole house for the second time. And then probably we will set up everything before we finalize the whole house. So after all the feeders will be assembled, we will all wash them with soap for sure. And then after that, we will all let it dry and then we will put them all in the house. Made two! Ben aku ya ibeb. Ini 
Nung na, gamay kaya na, daghan kaya kagamit. Kaya kung imo ni padakan, at was ito. Nawa. Wala. check it is currently 2 30 in the afternoon mag testing na daw me o patubig nag work wala there is water go Gin sa nung pagkabaluan ni Beb? Hmm? Gano kang kabaluan ni Tubero? Analyze. Good, very good, very good. Ano sa nung ikan? I guess that will be it for today guys. I hope you have enjoyed my short vlog for today and I shall return tomorrow. Bye for now.